Hey there, this is Marvel.com editor Mark Strom here at a special fan screening event for the season three premiere of Marvel's Agents of S.H.I.E.L.D. We'll be chatting with all sorts of cast and executive producers from the series. Stay tuned. Heading into season three now, what were going in some of the things that you set up as like, okay, these are the big themes or things that we want to explore in this season, or at least what you can say from the beginning? Well, I think now that we're opening up the world of Inhumans, um, a theme that we've been exploring is how our characters deal with their humanity in that world. Um, yeah, are you inhuman is sort of our our phrase for the year, our touchstone of that everyone is, there's obviously the question of any citizen and are they inhuman, but also, you know, everybody's dealing with sort of what line will they cross in order to achieve their goals or in order to get revenge or in order to, to feel uh, as powerful as these real inhumans. You know, these are the questions that we're sort of wrestling with. Yeah, we're exploring all aspects of what that question means. Yeah. And you bring up the sort of tagline of the season, or of the season so far. Are you inhuman? The tagline for the first season was not all heroes are super. And of course, in the first year, and even into year two, we didn't see very many uh, people with powers. They were here, they were there, but now it seems like this really opens up the doors to more. Uh, what? How does that change both Shield's mission statement and also your show, just in general, to be able to have that? Well, I mean, I think that one of the things we're dealing with this year is that not all supers are heroes, and so Shield's mission is is much clearer now. It's there are people who are changing, and, and and they are they are powerful, and so they can be used for good, they can be used for evil, and, and it's sort of Shield's job to determine who is inherently good and evil, because um, you know, with power comes. <laughs> A that's little bit of responsibility, yeah, just a touch kind of, of thing, it. Yeah. yeah, just a hint of it. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah. The the Churchill saying. Yeah, yeah. the famous yeah. Churchill yeah. saying. Yeah. 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 <laughs> you know, and going on that, I mean, how does having the powers sort of uh, expand the types of stories you can tell, or or the avenues you can go down? Well, uh, we like that it's an easy way to explain why someone has powers. Right. We and no longer have to have a meltdown at a power plant. Right. Then, yeah. it's, it's, it's definitely a lot more fun. But at the same time, just story-wise and character-wise, we're, we're always using the power as a metaphor for something. Um, so that, you know, we just as far as opening up what emotionally people are feeling and having that be represented in, in melting something. Um. <laughs> and, and, and asking the question of what it's like to be different and how do people react when something new comes into the world and uh, it allows us to explore those themes.